I mean, you're probably going to be tossing out food even when you don't want to. But depending where you live, none of it has to go into a landfill. Last year, the city of Minneapolis diverted 6,000 tons of organics by turning it into compost. So how do they do it? Good question. Heather Brown takes us from start to finish. Are people pretty good about putting the right stuff in this bin? They are, yeah. So we've got uh, some food scraps and compostable bags. I see eggshells in here. Yep. Yep, so any, any food scraps, pits, peels, tissues, cotton swabs, meat, bones, dairy products, paper products. How do you know if it's compostable? Yeah, so what you're looking for is the BPI certified compostable label. Um, there's this little icon. You're not shy about going through trash. Oh, no. <laughs> Kelly Kish is the Minneapolis Recycling Coordinator. Oh, you've been doing this long enough. Sure have. <laughs> this is the first step. Yep. Where do we go from here? Yeah, so from the curb, the organics will get picked up by one of our collection vehicles, um, and they are brought to a transfer station near Prospect Park. We're at the transfer station. Yeah. It's where the city trucks dump the organics, and then from here, they're put into semi-trucks. How often do they go into the compost site? Uh, they empty out the bunker here at the transfer station every morning, and that semi is going to take it down to um, Specialized Environmental Technologies Commercial Composting Facility in Rosemount, Minnesota. So people would know you better as the mulch store. Yes. Jake Duane is SET's director of organics development. All the organics get mixed up with yard waste? That's correct. Why? Yeah, but, uh, we need to have a the right ratio of carbon to nitrogen. This pile is going to sit here for about a month and a half to two months. What is the science of what's happening in this pile? So there's quite a lot of science. The biology is the microorganisms that are physically consuming all the food waste and the chemistry as those uh, microorganisms consume that material. They're breaking the chemical bonds and that releases heat and that heat will further help break down the material almost like it's cooking it. To 160 degrees. The next stage is off in the distance. Same material with any unwanted stuff screened out and there it sits for nine months. This right here is the final product. That's correct. Compost. A lot of people think compost is just dirt, but compost is more of a, a fertilizer that we can put into our lawns, into our gardens, onto roadside construction projects, anywhere you want compost and have a good, healthy soil. Do you ever think, this is pretty amazing to go from your trash to that? Heather Brown. That's why I got into the business. WCCO 4 News. Minneapolis estimates about 30% of people's trash are organics. Each city and county's programs are different. By the beginning of next year, all cities in Hennepin County will be required to have an organics program. Ramsey and Washington counties plan to have an organic pickup program by 2023. If you have a good question for Heather, email her by visiting wcco.com links.